so guys today we'll be looking at the course database management system it's nothing but dbm so for this course i suggest you to use this website java d point this is very useful for dbms i'll send this website link in the description box so here in this course you will be learning sql and plsql so for using sql you need to download a tool called mysql community or mysql workbench so this is the correct website i'll send this website link in the description box also but for plsql i suggest you to use oracle with this is an online form whereas um, plsql is an offline form so for online so for offline uh, i mean so for online i suggest you to create an oracle account like this so this is the login page so after creating an account in it you will view a page like this so this is the online form of live or sql so in this course dbms we will do a project this project is based on the website so in this this website should be created based on the management system so for example let me open my hpodge account so this is my hpodge account let's say in this self description box so this is um box i'm typing hello so here uh, this is how my front end part of the website looks like but uh, you can ask me how this looks like in the back end is nothing but it looks like this so this is how your website will be looking in the back end that is in the sql format so there must be a lang programming language which connects the front end as well as the back end that is your website as well as the sql which is nothing but php so this you have to learn this language on your own so none of the teachers will teach you how what is php and how it is you have to learn it is learn php on your own itself so php is a programming language which connects the website as well as the sql part which means you have to learn html i hope so, i hope you have learned the html in the first year itself so in this project you have to use the knowledge of html